from grade 4 mark. Welcome to our exploration of the three states of matter. Solid, liquid, and gas. Today we're going to dive into what makes each state unique and how they behave differently. Let's start with solids. Solids are objects that have a fixed shape and volume. This means they keep their shape no matter where you put them. Think about your desk, your pencil, or even your favorite toy. They all stay the same shape unless you change them. Let's explore solids with different examples. Here, I have a small wooden block. This wooden block is a solid. Solids can be made of different materials like wood, metal, plastic, or even rock. What's important is that solids have particles that are tightly packed together and don't move around much. Now let's observe what happens when you try to change of this wooden block. As you can see, the wooden block doesn't bend or change its shape easily. This is because the particles in solids are held together strongly by forces, making them maintain their shape and volume. Now let's talk about liquids. Liquids don't have a fixed shape, but they do have a fixed volume. This means they take the shape of the container they're in. Imagine pouring water from cup into a bowl. The water takes the shape of the bowl because liquids can flow and move around. Next, let's explore liquids. I have a pitcher of water here. Watch as I pour it into different containers. A cup, bowl, and a bottle. Notice how the water takes the shape of each container, but maintains its volume. This is because liquids can flow and adapt to shape their container. Lastly, we have gases. Gases don't have a fixed shape or volume. They can spread out and fill any space they're in. Think about the air around us. Gases are all around us, even though we can always see them. Finally, let's observe gases. I'll inflate this balloon using a portable electric air pump. As the gas fills the balloon, Notice how it expands to fill the space inside. Gases share particles that move freely and spread out, allowing them to fill any container or space they're in. In conclusion, we've seen how solids maintain their shape and volume. Liquids take the shape of their container while keeping their volume. And gases expand to fill any space. These demonstrations help us understand how different states of matter behave in our everyday lives. Thank you for watching. Stay curious and keep exploring the world of science. Bye-bye!